First tonight, attacked on the job, an Austin bus driver took a beating and police just released the video hoping to find the attacker. The assault happened on a bus at a stop in the 6,000 block of Techno Center Drive Friday morning around 11 o'clock. KXAN's Doug Shoup is there live with the investigation now, Doug. Well, Shannon, police say that the man waited for all of the other passengers to be off of the bus and then at this bus stop committed the crime, then took off running west towards some apartment buildings. Now, the bus driver's injuries to his face were so severe that he had to go to the hospital tonight. Other bus passengers and bus drivers who we spoke with say they are just simply shocked that something so violent could happen on a bus in broad daylight. The attack lasted about five minutes. We think this is an isolated incident, but something that definitely concerns us with the sheer brutality of it. Police edited surveillance video shows the man getting on the bus at Congress Avenue, moved from the back to the front, then officers say he got into an argument with the driver. It looks like that the verbal disagreement stemmed from the, from the fact that the bus driver didn't stop. Uh, and originally when the, when the uh, suspect was trying to get on the bus on Congress Avenue. Then suddenly and violently, the man repeatedly punches the driver with his fists, stops, then does it again. He got off the bus a few times, got back on, got off the bus a few times, got back on. So that was a very disturbing part of it. After the attack, police say the rider pulled the driver off his seat to the floor and went through his pockets to rob him. It should be on every operator's mind, what if? Bus driver Mike Calvary has been with Capitol Metro for four years. He greets every passenger and watches their body language. He also uses Cap Metro's training on how to defuse a situation, when not to engage with a passenger, and when to call for help. We never take chances as much as possible. Bus rider Patrick Jones moved to Austin from Chicago a year ago. Coming here, thought uh, I wouldn't see nothing like that, but it, it is shocking. He's seen passengers get agitated on the bus, but never thought a disagreement could turn so violent. It just makes me open my eyes more and be more cautious about who gets on and off the bus. Now, the bus driver who was injured is now out of the hospital. Police are not releasing his name at this point. His employer, Veolia Transportation, which contracts with Capital Metro, is offering a $5,000 reward tonight for any information that leads to an arrest. Reporting live in Far East Austin, Doug Shoup, KXA and Austin News.